I see this advice posted all the time. College is a scam. College is a complete joke. It's a waste of time and money. And the reality is for the most of you, that advice is complete bull because the truth is, if Sergio and I didn't go to college, then we probably wouldn't have been able to build our window cleaning business to over $65,000 a month while graduating completely debt free. So if you wanna know how we game the system and hack college to create a thriving six figure business, then kick that shitty advice to the curb and keep watching to the end of this video. Since Johnny and I came from low income families, we qualified for something called FAFSA. It's paid through the state for our tuition for us to go to college. And honestly, we got kind of lucky because of this. We would actually get seven to eight K per semester after paying for our tuition, which at the time was a ton of money. But why does this matter and what does it have to do with going to college or not? Well, you see every business guru on the internet right now saying college is a scam. College and university today is the biggest scam. Or college is part of the matrix. Just propagated mainstream by the matrix is done so with a Trojan horse. If we didn't go to college, then we probably wouldn't have been able to build our businesses. But how did we do it? We lived below our means and I'm talking so below our means that Sergio moved into my mom's house with me and we even slept on the same queen size bed together for six months straight. When we were in college and staying at my mom's house, we were able to take that financial aid money, use it to live off of while building our businesses on the after hours and on the weekends. You hear the same old rags to riches stories all the time. You take a successful entrepreneur who grew up hella broke, but eventually made something of themselves through trial and error by starting and launching a new business. And I'm willing to bet a large percentage of you guys watching this want to do the same thing, which leads me to ask you, you, what is the point of college and is it even worth it? Well, let's start with the obvious. If you want to go to school to be a doctor, lawyer, engineer, then college is an absolute must. It isn't for you if you come from a more well-off family where you can go work in a family business and pick up the skills and learn the ins and outs of it, or you have, again, a well-off family who's willing to fund or help you out in the launch of a new business. But if that's not you, then college might be a really, really good option for you. So why is it worth it if that's you? So when you're just getting into the workforce or you're just graduating high school, you will have zero skills. I am a surgeon! And the typical route to build these skills is on someone else's dime, and this is called a job. However, if you're anything like us, a job is the last thing you want to get. Especially because the jobs that are available to you right now are entry level and they're probably not going to be enjoyable to you. The other less traveled route is to build a business from scratch. How do you build a business with zero skills though? By suffering through a ton of pain and learning through trial and error. This can be done by starting a low barrier entry business like a home service business or internet based business. Now these types of businesses are great because they require small amounts of capital to start and the actual service delivery of the business is fairly simple. For example, Johnny and I start with only $150, but the reality going into this route is you're not going to make a ton of money up front and you need to go into this accepting that fact. You will have to put in the reps into things like sales, marketing, hiring, fulfillment, and the list goes on. But with putting in those reps will come tons of headaches. Things like potential customers rejecting you, people being unsatisfied satisfied with your service, lack of leads. Business is not all sunshine and rainbows. Oh, wow! It's starting to even look like a triple rainbow. And this is exactly what leads me back to the question. Why is college worth it if you're that specific type of person? If it's coming time for you to apply for college or you're around the age where you can go to college and still live with your parents, then you will likely qualify for financial aid. Financial aid will even cover community college, so don't worry if your grades weren't the best. You can do exactly what we did. What we did was we attended college, and by doing that, we were able to both receive financial aid, which allowed us to pay for our bills, rent, overall general living expenses, while we spent all of our time outside of school focusing and building the business. If we weren't receiving financial aid at that time and we were super dependent on the window cleaning business to pay our bills, then we would have likely made more emotional and reactive decisions because we would be focused on the short term and not the long term health of the actual business. On top of all that, you'll gain invaluable skills like learning to be social and communicating, which translates super well into sales. And let's be honest, when are you gonna be young and around a ton of people the same age as you of the opposite sex? Fortunately for us, we took advantage. Ah, ah. 
We did the bare minimum to pass our classes so we can spend all of our extra time and focus on our business. And this ultimately paid off for us because by the time we got to our senior years, we were making as much money as our professors. College was ultimately helpful because it made our decision concrete in the fact that Sergio and I knew that we could never go work a job because it allowed us the opportunity to try corporate internships to solidify that decision. Because what those corporate internships showed us was that entrepreneurship was the best path for us because after getting a taste of corporate, we both agreed that those were not the lives we wanted to live after we graduated. The decision to go to college is a personal one. So I hope that us sharing our story and our strategy behind how we game college will help you in your decision. And if you like this video and you got some value out of it, then you'll absolutely like this video right here where we talk about step-by-step -step how to grow a remote cleaning business. It's a perfect business to launch alongside your degree so you can build a business while going to school at the same time.